how much do you guys feel like the team will old when Terrence does what he did tonight? Well, we're way better when Terrence does what he did. Uh, just his ability in transition, just it takes so much pressure off of our our half court offense, and he's a freak athlete. Right? Just find him and he goes. It's easy. Is there something you noticed with him in the last couple of days or last week to try and getting back to what he was doing before he was out? Yeah, I think uh, it's just day by day in practice. He's uh, slowly kind of finding his rhythm, getting his confidence back. I mean, it's hard taking a break where everybody else is playing, like the game reps, it's, it's hard to come back. You know, I've had injuries where I struggled coming back. So, I mean, I know, like I feel where he's at and it just it just takes a little time. But like, I'm not worried. I know he's getting there and obviously he showed he's there tonight. What does he do? Is there anything in the game that he does that you're like, okay, yeah, that's like, he's back. Like, is it the transition, defense, is it threes? Like, is there anything you pinpoint? Or even like um, an expression he has? I, I honestly, just his body language. Uh, you can kind of see it like when he, he makes a play or he gets a defensive stop or something like I can just tell by looking at him like yeah TJ's back with us like he's here I don't know you can just you can just see it if, if, if you've been around him you can just tell I mean teams have consistently guarded Ty you know, loosely I think you know this one yeah when he can exploit it like he did tonight like how much difference does it make for you guys yeah I mean a lot you know teams can try to do the cross matching, put the five on them, do all that stuff. But, you know, we, we practice for it. We're prepared for that. Ty knows what to do. We all know how to play off Ty when they do that. So it's not really something that, you know, it's just another defensive coverage that teams are going to try to throw at us and stop us. But we have counters for everything. When he's Ty's rebounding like that and aggressive like that, like how much does that elevate where you guys are at? A lot. Our, our offensive rebounding is a staple of our team, and Ty's a big reason why it's a staple. Him, you, Coleman, Luke, probably the best offensive rebound we have, and it's just, it means a lot. Did Luke said something yesterday, it's like, I mean, Kelly's going to say, I won't get my time, but like, at this point, you know, it seemed to go games, you know, a little bit more, just to get, you know, road win, big town, bottom line, just like, how big is this one? Big, big, big 10 road wins mean a lot. It's, it's not your average game, a big 10 road win means a lot for us. What do you feel like you guys have shown halfway through the Big Ten season? I think we've shown that, you know, we can we can fight through a lot. You know, this team has gone through a lot already. And, you know, just through all the ups and downs, I think that we've just showed that we're a cohesive team. We stay together. And no matter what's going on, like, we're with each other and, and we're going to fight for each other. A four-minute stretch at the end of the first half with Dane and Coleman and TJ all with two and Imani and, and Dre coming, like, how much did that spark you guys and for freshmen to come in in that moment? Like, what that tell you about them? Yeah, I'm happy for them. You know, they they put in the work. You know, those guys are in the gym all the time. And they they understand that, you know, it's just not quite their turn to get all the minutes yet. You know, and they, they stuck with it. And they, they know their role. You know, they they just want to come in and help, help us win. And that's exactly what it is tonight. So... I'm really happy for them, and you know I'm glad I'm glad they did what they did because it, it helps us a lot. Kind of along those lines, Dane is a guy that Coach Underwood shouted out, and Ty, like how big were his minutes, and another guy who's really kind of up and down minute-wise yeah. to come in and have that impact. Yeah, Dane was huge for us. You know, with Coleman going out with some fouls and stuff like that, Dane Dane's ability to just rebound and his presence down low, I mean, it, it, it disturbs teams. You know, he's a He's by far our biggest, strongest guy, and when he plays like he did tonight, we're, we're a different team. You find yourselves, as Mark Ty said, when Terrence is TJ's at his normal self, we go to the glass because we can get him the ball and just go. Is, do you find yourself playing a little differently now, that, especially on the defensive glass, just because Terrence is that kind of a weapon? Yeah, definitely. I mean, when a team, if a team takes a bad shot, it's I mean, we're coming, we're coming right back at you when we got Terrence. So. I mean, I know me, me and Ty kind of search for him. You know, we get a rebound where we always know where he's at because he's just so dangerous in the open court that we want to take advantage of any opportunity we can with him. What you going to do with two days off now? I mean, you guys have been calling sleep. <laughs> <laughs> Getting the hyperbaric and sleep. That's, that's what I'm going to be doing. Thanks, Mark. Thanks, Mark.